<laughs> Look at that, you guys. That is some nice loot. Welcome back, everybody, to 7 Days, and I'm an old guy gaming, and this is the Ravenhurst mod, and in this episode, we are going to build our uh, rain barrel catcher thingamadoodle, and uh, so I also went out last night and harvested a bunch of chrysanthemum and some goldenrod and some grass to get berries and nuts, went fishing, so I got a bunch more fish uh, cooking up in here. The garden's not quite ready for us to harvest yet, but once we do harvest it, we will uh, bring in a nice little crop and we'll be able to actually start um, eating the produce from it. There's still a few more seeds I need to make, but all of the main stuff that we need in particular for making um, uh, hobo stew, uh, we will we'll be able to make. So uh, let's start by coming coming uh, here. And I got all the stuff I need for the rain barrels just waiting for you guys uh, to make that. So let's go ahead and uh, make the rain catcher. Um, oh, that's a perk? Wait, what? Okay, hold on a sec. Um, craft rain catcher. So, is this one of those deals where I can't actually craft it because I don't have the damn perk for it? Oh, come on, really, game? Are you, are you serious? Um, so we've got to get, we got to get land lover before we can actually craft it. Really? Oh, I hate that. I absolutely hate about that about this <laughs> stupid game, man. Or, or mod, I should say. Gosh, dang it. Um, Yeah, I I guess we have to wait. Shit. I guess we have to wait until we get that, that level. Oh, man, I was hoping we could get that done so that we could, um, you know, start getting water and jars and stuff. But I guess it's not meant to be. So I'm going to keep all of these ingredients in here. Not that. Oh, for Pete's sake. Okay, well, here we go again. Another Ravenhurst roadblock. <laughs> Ravenhurst roadblock. That's what we call these damn things. Um. All right, so that, let, let's look at this again. In order to get the perk for that, uh, we need, uh, was it Master Chef? No, not Master Chef, living off the land. Uh, so that's a strength thing. No, that's this thing. So that's going to require seven points in fortitude. We only have three points in fortitude. Plus, we'd have to get industrial farmer. That would allow us to do the fishing trap, which would be very useful. Uh, but I'm trying to. I'm, I'm also trying to fast track intellect so we can make the um, uh, what you call it? You know, the the mechanical bench, but in also the blacksmith's bench. I don't know. We might. What does this give? This gives a fishing trap, and I don't give a shit about the cannabis farm because I don't think the buff is worth the drawback for it. It makes you stronger, but it causes all kinds of other trouble, uh, like making you hungry, for example. Um, beehives, farm plots, and I don't know why in God's green earth I would want a farm plot, uh, but we get, we get harvest, you know, harvest three items and the rain collector. Maybe we better take a sidestep and see if we can push this out. I can also, um, let's see, I've got... Do, do, do. Oh, don't we have the fortitude glasses? I guess we don't. We need to be looking for those too, then, so we don't have to take the seventh point in fortitude. We can have an effective point. Oh man, that sucks. That sucks. Okay, well, you know, whatever. It's Ravenhurst. It's Ravenhurst. I'm not surprised by now. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, let's do this. Let's grab ten berries and ten. Uh, no, we got fifty. Yeah. 10 nuts and some pine seed and some blueberries. And we should be able to craft the nut mix, which I think we have to do in here. Uh, so survival mix. Uh, we can make two batches of that. And I don't, you know, I don't know how much that actually gives us, but it's, it's a lot of work to gather that many nuts and berries well, and you got to cut down the trees for the seed. So it's almost like something you would do, I think, when you just kind of naturally accumulate that as to going out and doing it deliberately. But I don't know. Let's see, you know, how much food does that give us? 20 food and 10 health. I mean, that's not that great, considering what a pain in the ass it was to get this stuff. You know, to, to be quite honest with you, I don't, I don't think that's all that fantastic. Uh, but, you know, whatever. It is what it is, and it's 
something that once you do kind of just come by that stuff without necessarily deliberately going after it, um, it's an option. So, okay, so we got a couple things of food there. We got all of the fish in here. So we got 45 pieces of fish. And we're doing pretty good. Let's just put all that in there, but we'll keep the... Does this give us a stamina buff? It doesn't. Uh, so we'll just keep a stack of fish with us. But we're actually doing pretty good on our food. Um, I had to make some more teas uh, because we were having problems with water. Oh, man, that sucks. It really does. Okay, well, I guess there's not no use in complaining about it. We'll just have to keep on keeping on. So we're still our only option for the moment for jars is is looting, uh, doing POIs. That's really the only option that we have at the moment. Let's grab another one of these uh, chrysanthemums. I wish my doggone garden was ready, but it's not, so. All right, we'll make one more red tea. That'll give us seven, and uh, that should keep us in good shape. So let's see, what are we going to do today? I think POIs and trader quests are what we need to do. Um... Because I need more jars so that I can make more concrete so that I can, you know, do the repairs and fix-ups that we need on the horde base, which isn't a lot. Uh, we don't have to do a lot, but we have some that we have to do. And I really kind of need to pay attention to this building, too. It's really getting the shit beat out of it. I got, you know, we kind of reinforced this edge of it where our, our ladder is, but we should probably go in and take a look at it and see if it needs some TLC right now. This uh, iron axe is just about ready to break, so I'm going to put it away and grab a stone axe. And um, I think we're I think we're ready to go. We don't actually have a trader quest, so we need to get one of those. And I'm going to actually put the coffee back in here uh, and save that for mining. And I think we have everything else we need to start questing. So let's put that there. I'm going to put the axe in this slot. Well, let's put the those in there, and I guess we can put the water in that slot. Uh, no, actually, we'll put that there. Okay, let's put our XP glasses on until we run into some fat loots. And our sledgehammer's starting to get a little bit low, but it's not terribly low. Okay, so... You know, the Zombos have these holes that they, they're climbing in and out of, so I think overall the structure is still in pretty good shape, just looking at the outside of it. Um, let's go take a peek inside here. I mean, they've been doing a number in here. That support's down, but I still have this central support, which they largely haven't touched. Because they kind of hang around in this area since I'm up there, you know? Oh, shit! She scared me. I didn't see her right there. So, yeah, it's not looking that bad in here. I think we're okay. Let's just leave it the way it is and uh, grab our mini bike and go talk to Trader Bomb get some quests. Um, we, are, we have a pretty ma major deficit in our XP because we died. We died so many times, man, in the last couple episodes. It's just nuts. Unexpected, you know. W one of the deaths was me being kind of stupid, uh, but having fun, too. So, what the hell, right? But two of them were just unexpected, like, oh my god, I can't believe it. Okay, let's uh, take see what you got for jobs. We want tier twos only, and preferably in town. So, do, 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 do this. Eh, I don't want to do it. Damn, buried supplies. Um, so, that one's to the west. Yeah, let's do this one. Whatever. I'm not sure how close we are to tier three either. Um... Now, he does have a motorcycle chassis that we just about have enough coin to get. Well, I got a couple things to sell to him, too. Let's go back and grab that stuff. Come on, Zeeks. Get away from my ladder. Let's grab our, our stuff for sell, sale and go do that. So we got uh, all of this stuff in here, basically. It's not a ton of things, but see, those are just shades. We got another pair of luckies, too. So we'll sell this stuff off and then go do that quest, uh, which is to the west. It's going to be that way. 
Yeah, we don't have a lot of repairing work to do on the base. We just have a lot of upgrading work to do. And we can't do that really until we start getting a significant amount of concrete, which we can't do until we get a significant number of jars in order to get the murky water to make the concrete. And you know how it is. That just on and on. It's one thing or another that we have to do. And yeah, so there you go. I uh, didn't shift click that. Five. Oh, yeah, never mind. Okay. That and that. So we got we made 1300 coin off of that stuff. That's yeah, not I'll too bad. Now. That should give us enough money to buy. Yeah, that gives us enough money to buy his motorcycle chassis. Should we just do it and make the motorcycle and be done with it? It's going to give us more storage space and it's going to move faster. Um But yeah, uh, uh, here. Okay. Let's look at it again. So he's got it. Bicycle chassis. Uh, where did we see that? Oh, maybe he doesn't have the motorcycle chassis. I thought he did. Or was that a different trader? Oh, he does. Okay. Yeah, so that's 11250 So we have enough to buy it, and I can make the handlebars. Um, if we ain't got what you're Tell you what, for, let's go do the POI first, because we might get super super lucky and actually find the find the frame or, or the chassis rather and if we don't then uh, maybe we'll come back and make the motorcycle so let's do it there it is okay um what do we got in here not a damn thing. We got the Mad Mole deal. We will take that. Let's check the mailbox too. We're not going to double loot though. We're just... Um, I'll scrap that for paper. It's not worth taking up an in inventory slot for three coin. We'll check the truck here and then we'll get started. Okay. Scrap that for some brass. Okay, so this is just a clear quest. Oh, I should have checked this cart, too. We could have gotten an extra thing of jars, but oh well. Now we got three jars out of that deal. So it wants us to go down below. <coughs> While we're here, might as well offload all of this stuff. Check this again. Nice. Very nice. Mineral water. We will take it. In fact, uh, I'm just going to drink it now to free up the space. There we go. Okay, let's head on down here. We have to be careful of feral zombos. Oh, there's mushrooms down here. Nice. We actually can take that stuff for the garden. Look at all the shrooms. That'll give us a jump jump start on the mushrooms. Okay. She's just a normal Zombo. She's not feral, so I'm not too worried about her. This is a normal biker. Okay. Oh, for Pete's sake. I put my freaking arrows away with the, you know, the stupid button. <sighs> okay, well, we won't be using arrows in this one. So, I guess we're just going to... Here, can we get a sneak shot off on the biker? Let's try it. Turn our flashlight off. Oh, come on, man. That's horse shit. I was at, like, only seven points on the sneak scale. Let's actually stay in here where we can maneuver a little bit better. Don't wreck any of those mushrooms. Anybody in here? All 
Marlene's down. Ring around the rosies. Nothing in there. He's dead. Alright, let's check this. Nice. And I guess we have to harvest the shrooms. Like so. Yeah, this will give us a nice little jump start on the garden. I only have one thing of shrooms in the garden right at the moment. They seem to be taking a million years to grow, too. I'm wondering if I'm not doing something right. Cool. So that gives us 36 mushrooms. Very nice. Very nice indeed. All right. Let's check in here. Not a damn thing. Give us some jars. Nope. Don't want that. There we go. Nothing over here to loot. Is there something underneath there? There sure is. There's a freaking ammo pile. All right. You know what? We're going to put these on for this because you just never know what you might pull out of an ammo pile. Okay. Not terrible. Not awesome, but not terrible. Where are those zombos at? Food pile. Nice. We got some chili. Take it. There's a duffel bag. Four jars. Beautiful. This is a good room to fight in because we can maneuver and there's also obstacles in the zombies' way so they can't just come straight for us. Off with your head. else back here oh we got a chem station that it doesn't work let's see what's inside of it though all right i'll take that we could wrench it later maybe later i'm not going to do it right now okay that's good book bookshelf come on give us something good nice uh targets with full health take 20 percent more damage with the shotgun oh i love that one Absolutely love it. That's going to help a lot. Scrap a doodle of that. Nope. There, pick that up. We can sell that for 30 coin. It's barely worth taking up an inventory slot for, but it is. Okay, before we go anywhere else, let's go back up to the bike and offload since we're really heavy. Here's a zombo walking around out, out here. Okay, let's put all this stuff in here. Well, we don't care about that. Yeah, I think, you know, actually I don't care about those either. Well, how much could we sell those for? Eh, definitely don't want the nails. Yeah, I think I'm going to chuck them just because, you know, inventory space is so precious. Okay, let's go back. So, yeah, I think, you know, making the motorcycle is going to help a lot because it's going to give us quite a bit more slots. Not to mention it's going to go faster. The downside, though, of course, is it's going to cost us more gas. So we'll have to deal with that. What's in here? the hell? Toilet paper? Really? That gives us like a 10% dysentery thing? That's not bad. I'll take it. Come here, Ronnie McNaughty. Get a bleed on you. Go that way. Nope. Come this way. Nope. Go this way. 
Nope, come this way. <laughs> Dude, I'm just messing with you. Okay. This goes back outside. Interesting. You dead? Let's check the car. Awesome. We're getting more jars. Get more jars. Oh. I tried to hit the button and it wasn't doing its thing. Right, come at me, bros. Another Zeker right there. Come here, Steve. Oh, he's mad now. He's coming at us after us. Have a sledgehammer sandwich. Alright, here's Zombo over in this vicinity. You know what? I don't think I've ever been in this PI before. I don't recognize it. Okay, kitchen looting time. Give us jars. Jars, jars, jars. Let's just look in here really quick. I wished I would have brought my freaking uh, arrows with me, man. So irritating. There. Oh, that scared me. Purse down here with nothing in it. Some leather for us. What kind of shenanigans we got going on in here? Okay, let's go back and do the kitchen. Let's head on upstairs. All right, we got two Zeeks in there. I wondered if he was going to do that. Oh, shit. We got a crawler. almost dead. You should uh, be almost dead too. Okay, back upstairs. You know what? I think I have been in this place before. It's just been a long time. Okay, let's check this. Still waiting for you to give me a toilet pistol game. And we'll take the shit. We need that too. For fertilizer. Hey, buddy. Oh, feral crawler. Alright, I don't think we're gonna kill him in one knife hit. Okay, he did. Collapsing floor. That would just go back down where we were. Let's check the bookcase. 
Nothing. Okay, this is game. This is your chance to give us a freaking uh, backpack upgrade. It's not working, you guys. It just, I am absolutely convinced that it's not working. Because, I mean, think about it. These are all the slots I've been able to open up in, what are we on, episode 45-ish? I've been doing this playthrough for a couple of months now, maybe? Something like that. So I think what we're going to do is I'm going to just spawn some in. I mean, because I should have way more inventory space than I do now. I hate to do it, but, you know, what am I what, what am I supposed to do? I can't play the rest of this playthrough with no freaking back sp backpack space. It's just been nothing but a pain in the ass. Okay, let's um harvest this and this. Let's go upstairs. Who knows what we're going to run into up here, so let's get the shotgun ready. All right, nothing on this floor here. More food. Chicken soup. Man, I need a soup stock, and then I can make a gumbo. Let's chuck that. And we're going to scrap that just to save a spot this we're gonna that's 31 that's 31 okay we'll keep those and i guess we'll keep the rest of this i need to be taking these these doors apart because you know we get the hinges from them. i just never think to do it bumbos there's three of them all right the bleeds going. I don't know, am I even hitting Biker? No, now we're hitting him. Stamina. Alright, screw you guys. We got a double off of that one. Nice. Return to trainer. Okay, quest is finished. Let's go get the fat loots and get the hell out of Dodge. Uh, but, yeah, I'm going to take the doors so that we can get the the hinges for more storage. Just looking to see if there's anything hidden in these spots. We do have luckies on, right? Yeah. Let's check the weapons bag. Six steel. I'll take six steel. That does not suck. Nice. <laughs> Look at that, you guys. That is some nice loot. That is some really nice loot. Okay. So we just uh, re uh, retired our AK, and we are moving to the assault rifle. Very nice. I'll take it. I will take it. All right. And that wasn't even the fat loots. Here's the fat loots. Let's see what we get. All right. Let's, uh, how much does this sell for? Yeah, uh, we're just going to scrap that for the leather, and then the rest of this we'll take. Wow, nice. Very nice. Can't complain about that, huh? Uh, we are se severely encumbered, though. So, uh, yeah. I'm gonna, I, I hate to do this, but, again, we just we got to get some space back. So we're going to scrap those. And... Um, are we thirsty? We're a little thirsty, but not a bunch, so I don't really want to... Here, we can eat the cat food. That doesn't have any recipes. And we'll chuck the can, because we got tons of cans. All right. We're slow, but we can still maneuver. Here, let's do this, too. Let's go uh, modify. Take those off of there. Put the our shiny new 
uh, assault rifle here. Very nice. Okay. Moving up on the world, slowly but surely. All right, guys. Well, I think I'm going to... Um, I think I'm going to let you go here just because we... Um, pretty much out of time. And the tentative plan for the next episode is to make the motorcycle. And then probably just keep doing uh, POIs for now. Am I missing something? Oh, yeah. Oh, there is a bookcase over here. Oh, shit. Um, here. Go away, bear. Okay. Let's check the bookcase in the desk. Dynamite schematic. All right. Actually, I shouldn't have done that because I already know it from the, the perks. We could have sold it, but whatever. Uh, that's worth selling. And let's check the nightstand in the the uh, filing cabinet. See? No freaking backpack upgrade. It's broken. Got to be broken. There's just no other explanation for it. Okay. That bear is making me a little bit nervous. Let's have, keep the shotgun ready. I think he's on the other side of the house. Okay, guys. Well, anyway, um, yeah, what I'm going to do is uh, go back to the base. I'm going to buy... Um, why did I pick something else up? <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, we don't need the nails. We'll get rid of that. We don't need the wood. We'll get rid of that. Uh... Let's get rid of the light bulb because I have a few of those. We just got to get back to the bike, but man, I hope that bear doesn't come around the corner. Anyway, uh, what was I saying? Oh, I'm going to go home. I'm going to buy that motorcycle chassis from the trader and and make the motorcycle. So when we start the next episode, I should have a shiny new motorcycle. That shopping cart is purple. Is it? No, it's just the light coming off of there. And then... Um, yeah, we'll probably just keep doing POIs for another day or two. Uh, 63 is the next horde day, so probably come 62-ish. We will um, hopefully have enough jars accumulated to where we can make enough concrete so that we can get you know the upgrades and repairs done on the horde base in preparation for horde 63. Now, um, it is my intention, just to let you guys know, that you know we're probably not going to necessarily use that horde base for the whole rest of the playthrough um you know the the uh, the first horde base with the explosives was much more productive in terms of xp so i might go back to to that or a, a, you know a similar type of design uh, the other thing i want to let you guys know is that it is still in my plans eventually for us to move down south uh to the, to that larger city um we just, you know, I just really haven't been in a position yet to effectively do that. But, you know, the motorcycle will help with that because it'll give us more storage and we'll be able to, you know, haul more stuff down there without having to make 5 million trips. So, you know, that is coming up at some point. I just couldn't, can't tell you exactly when we're going to do it, but I am still planning on, you know, making the move. So, uh, what, and, and, you know, in the process of that, building a real base or, you know, making making some kind of a real base whether it be a POI that we move into or building something from scratch or whatever. We'll have to figure that out when the time comes. Uh, but anyway, let's go, right before I let you go, let's just go check the garden really quick and see if it's uh, ready to pick. Because if it is, then I'm going to also work on that off camera. And, uh, you know, we, we still have a few more seeds to make, but like, like I've said, you know, we're going to be able to start using the produce from it, which is going to be really good. So, yeah. No, nope, it's still not quite ready yet. Man, it sure takes a long time. Well, wait, is it? No, it's still growing. Okay. Yeah, it's still growing. So, yeah, um, if this all matures before I start the next episode, I'll do that too. 
um, and we'll go from there. Okay, so guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, you know what to do. Please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share the video, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.